Hi, my name is Sarah Fletcher, and for my MEMS 5001 optimization project, I analyzed wind farms to optimize power output first cost. Wind energy has an important role as an alternative energy resource as more and more countries and companies are trying to decrease dependency on fossil fuels. Because wind farms require specific conditions, it is imperative that the farms use their space as efficiently as possible. As wind passes through a turbine, wake effects decrease the wind velocity downstream. These array losses lead to less power produced by the downstream turbines. A number of researchers have attempted to optimize wind farms with genetic algorithms. They have used binary GAs to model wind farms with a matrix of ones and zeros where ones represent a turbine and a zero is an empty space. A population of arrays undergoes a mixture of crossovers and mutations while attempting to minimize the objective function. Within a generation, crossovers occur significantly more frequently than mutations, but mutations are also required to ensure that the population does not become sterile and reach a local minimum. The results from previous researchers vary in solutions. Slight changes in the parameters based on their assumptions have led to a wide variety of solutions. Some of my notable assumptions are that the wind is only coming from one direction, the wind speed is continuous, momentum is conserved, and that the wake effects only influence the wind speed down one row of turbines, so laterally neighboring turbines don't feel the downstream effect. I have chosen a number of parameters for my problem, including selecting the blade radius to be 20 meters, the plot for each potential turbine to be a square whose length is and width are 5 times the diameter of the blades, a total array for the farm to be 10 by 10 plots, and an upstream wind speed of 12 meters per second. The objective is to minimize cost while maximizing power productions, so this objective function weighs minimizing cost per power more heavily. The cost equation is derived from Mosetti's analysis, a simplified non-dimensional cost per year for n number of turbines in a given farm. The power equation is based on wind turbine power analysis, where u, the wind speed, is varied based on how many turbines are in front of the turbine being analyzed. The total power is the sum of the power produced by each individual turbine. Currently, my average results are as shown. With a population of 600 and 1500 generations, my solutions have an average objective function of 0 0.0015, the cost is 25 per year for the farm, and the total power is 1500 kilowatts, and the efficiency is 80%. This is an example of an optimized field. As you can see, generally, the turbines are spaced farther apart, getting rid of unnecessary turbines that aren't contributing significantly more power. This graph plots the mean and minimum fitness functions in each generation, and the trend is as expected where it decreases linearly, sharply at first and then tapers off as a more optimum solution is approached. Moving forward, I am interested in fine-tuning my objective function hopefully to raise the efficiency a little bit. It would also be interesting to modify the analysis to account for different wind intensities and directions, to optimize for the rotor diameter as well, and to set up a function to place a desired number of turbines as efficiently as possible on the farm. So that concludes my analysis thus far. Thank you so much for watching.